Do you like the name Ruby? You can imagine on a cute little girl. How about a tramp? Yes, this is Ruby. Every hour on the hour, she arrives here at Subi train station and whisks people around Subi, Shenton Park and up to Kings Park. First up, she's free to travel on and I'm not leaving the dog behind because Ruby loves your furry friends as much as you do. Come on, Soda Pop. Hup. I did mention it's a free service, didn't I? And the reason for that is because Ruby is run entirely by volunteers. From the drivers who take turns driving the route once a fortnight, thank you, John, to the friendly tram hostesses like Judith. Super friendly. No, she does know that's a tree. It's also a local sculpture. And it's part of the quirky things to see along the way. My Ruby is now funded by local businesses. Originally, she was the result of a very innovative and generous act by one of Subi's most ardent supporters. And if I'm right, yes I am, there she is now. Nikki, I love Ruby, but what on earth made you think you should spend your money on a tram between Subiaco and Shenton and Kings Park? That's a good question, yeah. Christy. I didn't actually think about the money at the time. Trams have always been a huge part of Subiaco in the past, and I always felt there was something really missing in Subi in the recent years, and I just decided it was the trams. So once you came to that decision, how come you decided that dogs were allowed on the tram? Well, I love dogs and I hate rules and I thought, why can't the dogs come and travel with us? Fair call. Nikki, I hate to ask a lady's age, but how old actually is Ruby? Well, Ruby is a bit younger than you probably think. Ruby is actually just coming up for her 50th birthday. She was built in the early 80s for the America's Cup. Oh, so but she's not original then? No, but she's all the materials that have been used are original and all the design is original, so in every way she and is. And a beautiful bell out the front. Oh, yeah. Right. It's all a replica. Yes. <laughs> Nikki, how do you actually hail Ruby down? Oh, that's really easy. You just you see it coming, you just put your hand up and um, when you want to get off, you just ring a bell and you can hop off wherever you want. Ah, I can ask one last one. How did you decide to go all the way up to Kings Park? What was the reason behind that? Well, basically, I just thought it would be a really nice way for people to be able to get up and enjoy Kings Park in a couple of hours up there and then come back down again to Subiaco. So it was really just to create a bit of a marriage between the two areas. Ruby is such a great way to connect Shetton Park, Subi up here in Kings Park, and she is just gorgeous for residents, for people like you and me, for dogs like Soda. She actually has a Facebook page and she has a website page, so check them out. And she runs every Tuesday through until Saturday. Did you want to get a coffee? Yes, we're going to go get a coffee. <laughs>